Hi guys! Here we go again with the reported speech. Yay. In the previous video, we talked about reported statements, but what about questions? Do you know how to report questions? Let's put your knowledge to the test. A reported question is when we tell someone what another person asked. Reported questions are not questions as such anymore. Huh? So there is no longer a question mark. And most importantly, the sentence structure changes into that of a statement. So forget about inversions. Reported questions follow the logical order of a sentence. Subject, verb and complement. The most commonly used verb to report questions is ask, but instead of ask, we can also use want to know or wonder, depending on the nuance of meaning that you want to convey. We'll illustrate how and when to use each of them in a minute. Once again, let me emphasize that our reported question will take the form of a statement rather than a question, so no more inversions with auxiliary verbs. Now, just stuff your cheat sheets with all the changes that you learned for reported statements because you'll have to make all those changes in pronouns, determiners, verb tenses, and expressions of time and place when reporting questions too. As you know, we usually distinguish between yes or no and WH questions. We'll look at them separately because the way we report them is slightly different too. Let's kick off with yes-no questions. The structure for reported yes-no questions will be somebody asked someone, you can include the object or omit it, if or whether, whichever floats your boat, but please mind the spelling of whether, and then subject, verb, and complements. Last week, I had a video call with my bestie Julia, who lives in Chicago, and she's a bit curious. So she asked a stack of questions. Hi, Anna. I was hoping I could ask you a couple questions. Do you miss your students? Julia asked me if I missed my students. Did you win the ugly Christmas sweater contest? Julia wanted to know if I had won the ugly Christmas sweater contest. Have you finished watching The Queen's Gambit? Julia asked me if I had finished watching The Queen's Gambit. Will I ever go back to Morthia? Julia wondered if she would ever come back to Morthia. Let's now move on to WH questions. And the structure is somebody asked someone, again with or without the object, WH words, and then subject, verb, and complements. What's the time in Spain now? Julia asked me what the time was in Spain at the moment. Why do Spanish people kiss each other on the cheek even if they're total strangers? Julia wanted to know why Spanish people kiss each other even if they're total strangers. Notice that we don't change the verb tense here because we're talking about something that is generally true. How long did it take you to make this video? She asked me how long it had taken me to make the video. When will this corona nightmare be over? Julia wondered when the corona nightmare would be over. If you need to take another look at how the verb tense changes, you can always rewatch the reported statements video. And now that you already reported question pros, uh, yeah. let's check what you've learned so far. You've now got 10 seconds to change the following questions into reported speech. Mom, can we eat pizza tonight? Yay! Anya asked me if they could eat pizza that night. Where have you put my thermos? Alan 
wanted to know where I had put his tennis. There are some of the sentences which are interrogative too, but we'll look at them separately. We'll deal with them together with offers, requests and suggestions. So, make sure you don't miss any of the videos and keep pushing!